Hey, what's up everybody? My name is TrophyNut and welcome back to XCOM Enemy Within on the Valkyrie playthrough. The Valkyrie playthrough means that we will only be using female soldiers and no male soldiers will be allowed. So last time we were hit with a few abduction sites and we're gonna check out the United Kingdom with our original squad. And then, uh, well, just let's go kick some alien ass. Here we go. So hopefully we can get some meld. The next deployment site is in the UK. Local government force. And the rest of the panic in the other continents will be uh, limited. Although we do not need to worry about that too much for now. And Europe seemed to be in the most trouble. We should be able to get the four engineers as a reward here. Check out those ladies. Okay. Solid copy, Big Sky. Strike one is clear to engage. So we have a pretty big building with a fountain in front of it. And not a lot of cover, so I do want to get to the sides really quickly. I'm gonna do that by going to the right over here. So let's see. I'm gonna go ahead and put the heavy in front. Yeah, okay. And then move the assault along the back as well as wise our aye support. Aye. And leave the sniper around here somewhere. Don't wanna activate something. Aye, aye. There we go. The sniper hunker down and the rest will go in overwatch again. We don't really have a good view on a melt canister yet. Not even a slight indication. I'm gonna quickly look around if I can see anything. But nothing for now, so I hope I'll get at least one. Because I do want to turn one of these ladies into a mech. Okay. Heading there now. Ooh, that gives us our first peek inside of the building. Looking good for now. Moving to position. There we go. I think we're in pretty good oh position. Overwatch, no grenades, please. Because, oh, of course. The meld is over there somewhere. Ah, uh, here. I can see it over here. Yeah, we're not gonna get that. Damn it, I should have looked first. Um, let's go to the door. Yeah. Get a bit closer. Heading out. Don't really need to put her in cover for now. Heading to that location. And then everybody back in Overwatch. And now we'll kick in the door with Yang. And there definitely are aliens inside of the building. So let's try and open the door. Nothing yet. Let's put the assault inside. Aye, aye, Commander. Hostile yeah, there we go. I hope they move into sight of my sniper. Which they sadly don't. I'm gonna leave her there though. Uh, have to be careful. Because if I move too far into the building, the shot is blocked. The only shot we really have is this one. I'm gonna wait and try and circle around here. How far can she go? Okay, that's good for now. Let's put our heavy a bit closer. 
Moving well, that's out. actually not a bad position. Ah, god damn it. Okay. Could have used that bazooka right now. We could try and take a shot at that one. Although I only have half cover from that angle. And 34% shot to that one. Mm-hmm. So yeah, I'm gonna try and do that. Go Yang! The scope should help here a bit, but no such luck. Yeah, do we? So that's a useless shot, so I'm gonna pull her back. So we lose sight of that one, and then I'm gonna use smoke on all three of us, if that's remotely possible. Yeah, there we go. This is damage control, ladies and gentlemen. But especially for the ladies here. And then an overwatch shot with a sniper to counter any of the sectoids moving outside. Okay, that's an interesting decision. Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay, great. So he's gonna fire. Yeah, he missed. And there we have our sniper overwatch. Bam! Okay. Don't see that often. A rookie, uh, a squatty. Sniper hitting an overwatch shot. Ooh, that's gonna hurt. Okay. Oh, they were going for that one. So those two join the fray. And I might just be able to bazooka them. And I have another shot. But first, I don't think there are any overwatch shots. We killed that one. That one shot. That one shot and that one mind melded and those two just joined us. So what can the rocket do? I think I can get all three of them. Yeah, okay. That's superb. I'm gonna do that. That's too good to pass up. Go Yang! Boom! Yeah, boom! Bam! Triple kill! Okay, that was amazing. She does have another sniper shot. I'm first gonna check what I can do with... Oh yeah, I can go straight up in his face. But yeah, why not? Try that shot as well. Oh, missed. Okay. Would have been worth the experience. But, running gun. So we had six. Hopefully we don't trigger any more. Yeah, there we go. 100% shot. Hopefully three damage, otherwise I'm screwed. Yeah, there we go. Six damage in the face. And that kills the mind melded one as well. Bam. Cleaned out. Okay, so we do have more aliens. Probably another... To that doublet or sectors. I'm gonna purposefully break the window so they move along and try to come to us. Because they must have heard that. We still haven't found any melt, by the way. So I'm wondering where that second canister is. Is that it? Probably not. Okay, so let's move her up. I'm gonna break another window just to see if we can't flush anything out. Oh, it's already broken. Never mind! Let's move our sniper up as well. Okay. Nothing triggered. And then I'm gonna use the assault to okay. 
scout ahead. Um, just overwatch. I don't think I have to reload for two uh, or three extra sectoids. Okay, they're so they're. What the hell huh. is that? They're somewhere. They're probably here then. But I can't get there that quickly. You know what? I'm first gonna open this door. Okay, nothing. So then I'm gonna move here. Heading out. Let's see if she can't see anything through the door. No, okay. Open that up. And then move her. No, go Yang. Closer in that direction. Uh, that door is closed, so she won't see anything. I wonder if I should risk that. Far ahead, can we see? Aye, aye, Commander. Alien object in sight. So she saw the melt. Okay, it's over there. Uh, I think it will be faster just to kill the aliens that are left. So moving ahead to where the aliens are supposed to be. That door is still closed and I don't think there's anything over here. So I'm gonna try and move her okay. up. Yeah, okay. Didn't think I would trigger anything by doing that. Overwatch everybody else and reload. Ruby. Okay, there goes another window. We kind of destroyed this office space. God damn it! That's one melt canister down the drain. So yeah, I'm gonna open the aye door aye, from here. So I might get a flank with my assault over here. Enemy oh, there's <laughs> wow! They're right in front of the door. Okay. So that means. Do we have a sniper shot? No. Sadly. I have a grenade, so I can kill one of them. Um, the other one... I have running gun again. So I can flank this guy. Which I'm gonna do. On the move. Visual on the goods. Okay, there's the meld. And then I'm gonna kill this fellow. Hello. Four damage, thank you. And the door broke down for some reason. I'm not gonna reach for the grenade. Oh. Ah, too bad. It was worth a try. She could. I wonder. Nah, it's too risky. I'm gonna try with the heavy though, with Yang. Just to get someone else to kill. Oh yeah, okay. Goodbye. Another day, another successful operation. There we go. So I think we should have at least two promotions. One for Ruby and one for Yang. really came through on this one. I'm glad everyone made it back safely. So, big bonus, and now we got squad sight, which allows us to shoot any target that's in, uh, well, in the line of sight of Ruby and that an other member has sight on as well. So we can technically shoot from across the map. So, for the heavy, that's less determined. So we got flush which can uh, cause enemies to run out of cover which is kind of useless I think because they usually just run into another piece of cover so uh, I'm gonna go for opportunist 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 which eliminates the aim penalty on reaction shots and reaction shots can perform critical hits so opportunist it is and then I'm gonna keep the scope so we have 88 aim on, well, any reaction shot. 
So, nice bonus, I think. And then we get four engineers and another medal. There we go. We didn't... We only blew up three. So we lost six weapon fragments and we got one piece of meld. So panic increased in South and North America, but in the United Kingdom it has decreased. Remember, we will be watching. And more importantly, the panic in Russia and France didn't rise as well. Because that would have filled that bar up immediately. So I'm going to check out this really quickly. I have six days for the council report. And... Engineers arrived this morning, Commander. We're always glad to have more help down here. We now have enough engineers to build a satellite uplink. But I'm gonna... I really want to build the steam generator too. So I might just excavate a bit more. Just to keep them busy. And then... We're gonna soon need a med kit, so I'm gonna build one in a second. Because... I think I'm gonna get another engineers when the week ends. So beam weapons is still slow. Um, I'm gonna check out the medals. And maybe hire two more soldiers again. And hopefully we get another woman. So, two more badges. We still got the five defense in cover. I'm gonna award that to one of the assaults. I'm gonna start with Blake. There you go. And then we've got the International Service Cross, which we first need to assign a power to. So, either plus two will per different nationality in the squad, or plus two aim per continent bonus XCOM has earned. That means that the person receiving this uh, medal will immediately receive a plus two aim bonus, which is, I think, more useful than the will bonus. So I'm going to use the aim per continent bonus. There we go. And award that to... I think Weiss's aim is already 80 plus. So maybe the sniper could use that. There you go, Ruby. And then I think we don't have anything else to do than just wait it out. There we go. Satellites are complete. We are ready to deploy it on your orders. I'm gonna continue scanning. And we're gonna stop right before the end of the month. Because now we can launch one satellite. Only one. Um, and as I said before, I really want the We Have Ways bonus. So I'm gonna start by giving Argentina another satellite well not another just one satellite here we go so that gives me 70 credits extra per month uh, which will be increased by 30 percent as well because of our uh, africa bonus and we get an another scientist per month as well so there we go so it also warns us about the fact that there are no um, interceptors available in uh, South America which we're gonna change immediately by ordering one I'm gonna keep it at one because we're really pressed for funds because we only have eight credits left uh, but I am going to check out the soldiers that just arrived we got Jacob and Ingrid Jacob is probably a guy so sorry Jacob but I can't use you and your aim is terrible so, dismiss Jacob. De Groot. Oh, from... Oh, okay. And then Ingrid is, I believe, a woman. Sadly, also 55 aim. And a terrible will stat. But I can... I'm gonna take any female soldiers I can get. So now we have 10, I believe. So 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Starting to count up really nicely so then the council report there we go we are extremely impressed with the progress of the XCOM project thus far commander your recent results were beyond our expectations and that is not a statement this council makes lightly 
So, they're very pleased with us. Uh, as we can see, we shot down one UFO, stopped two abductions, launched a satellite, three research projects were completed and we raided that shot down UFO. All great, all super, and we got an extra country that supports us now, which gives us a monthly reward of 318 credits, a scientist and an engineer. So we can't do any better, really, uh, because we didn't lose any countries as well. So, let's carry on. We will be in touch, Commander. Yeah, you will. So I usually like to get two interceptors in each country, but since we're really pressed for funds, as you can see, we st though we got 381, we had some uh, monthly expenses as well for maintaining the hangar and the soldiers, so we only have 231 credit. Um, which leaves us with just enough money new engineers arrived this morning commander we're always glad to have more help down to build a thermo generator sadly and not much else what we also want to want to have in the near future i'm gonna first build this as we're gonna want to have uh, at least a workshop although that's less pressing although i really want one I want the Snibernetics Labs either this month or the next month to get our first mech rolling around. We're good on power now because of the thermo generator. I think he uh, he supplies 20 power so we're gonna be at 50 after it's built. So we're gonna be able to build pretty much every anything uh, on a power basis. Uh, laboratories I'm gonna wait but the most important thing we're gonna need is a satellite uplink to uh, launch those extra satellites. What's even more pressing... From what little I've seen of their technology, the aliens were intent on conquering... ...is that we need more satellites because of the extra engineers. So we now only need to pay 67 credits for a satellite. And I do want to get two more than we already have uh, with the satellite uplink. I'm going to show you that. Now we're going to put the satellite uplink here which allows us normally to get two more satellites up but because they're right next to each other we can add another one we get one extra that we can deploy so that asks for a lot of money so we're gonna sell a lot more sectoid corpses i'm gonna start with that um i'm gonna keep the alloys and i'm gonna sell some illyrium as well since we won't be using that right now how much do i need for uh the satellites 67 so that's 134 for two i'm gonna have to wait i can't afford to wait because satellites take 20 days to build so i have 10 days to get those funds ready so there's not much much else to do and start scanning i think yeah there we go, our second UFO, and it's in Africa still, so here we go. It's again a small one, so we should be able to take it down. Well, it's up to luck here, because we don't really have... Oh, that's one hit. Oh, that's a miss. There we go, okay, great. Well done. So that's another UFO crash site on a small scout. So we're gonna send the Sky Ranger. A heavy would be nice. Sniper we're still gonna need because the, the open spaces would be really handy. And those and White and Blake didn't have any uh, promotions yet. So I'm gonna need to get those for them. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna still keep the same team, but before that we're gonna take a break. So I thank you guys enormously for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, don't forget to like this video and subscribe. And don't forget uh, to leave names for any of my soldiers, custom names for any of my soldiers in the comments. Uh, if I see them, I will add them immediately to the game. So thank you guys again for the support and for watching. And I hope to see you in the next video. Goodbye!